All right, people. It's time to talk about a serious topic right now. This topic is, do sales matter? Now, don't don't get me wrong, and I know some of you are definitely guilty of this. Sometimes we use sales to validate our arguments, whether we explain why this game is great, why this movie is great, why this book is great because it sold this much, it was critically acclaimed and all this. But let's really think about it real quick. Let's really think. Do sales do sales compensate a good movie, a good game, a good book, a good comic book, etc.? Let's really th think about that for, for a minute. Let's really think. Because let's really think of some bad movies. All right. The, the example that comes to mind as far as a bad movie goes is Resident Evil, the Resident Evil series. It might not be bad to some, but let's be real here. To most people, it's very bad. It's a bad combination of an action film. But it sells tremendously well. Now, do the sales compensate of it being a bad movie? Exactly. Let's look at Call, Call of Duty, for example. We're not going to include Call of Duty 4. Let's include Call of Duty, World at War, Black Ops, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3. Do these games bring anything new to the table? You might have different opinions, but I'm going to say my piece. I think these games offer nothing new to the table. Of course, it may be a different first-person shooter from Halo, Killzone, or Resistance. But, it's still the same old shooter. It hasn't changed from Call of Duty 4, let alone the other Call of Duties before that. So, it sells tremendously well. But, it offers nothing new to the table. It even gets good reviews, surprisingly, by GameStop and IGN. Games, GameStop, I'm sorry, GameSpot and IGN say it's an awesome game. But they criticize other creative games or past games saying it's the same old thing. That may be true, but when we all review Call of Duty, it's a whole different story. See, even critics don't compensate for a good game or a good movie. Especially sales. Especially sales. i seen the Resident Evil movie. As an adaptation, it's garbage. As a movie, without even playing the games, it's garbage. When I see the Resident Evil movies, you know what I think? Or matter of fact, you know what I want to do? I want to watch every action movie it is copying from the matrix and the sequels from blade from die hard i would rather watch those films those original films i would rather have an original content than a straight up cat than a straight up copycat As you heard you heard that right i would rather have something original than a copycat And and Call of Duty, what more need, needs to be said that hasn't been said already? So, the moral of this whole rant and this whole video is sales and critics or reviews do not compensate whether a game, movie, book, comic book is good or not. It's all a matter of how a person feels about it. Everybody has different opinions. Everybody see, sees things differently. That is what makes us human beings. That is what makes us unique. Everybody's unique. And unfortunately, unfortunately in games and movies, there's no uniqueness. There's not. There's, there's some, but there's not a lot. It's, 
is how I would say it. All the copycats get good recognition. All the unique get below recognition. Below recognition. That's how I see it. So, yeah, that is my video. You have any thoughts? Post them down in the comment section, and we will talk. Peace.